The October storm has come and gone, and some people still don't have power four days later. The numbers are dwindling, though. In Rhode Island, less than 7,000 people are still in the dark. Eyewitness News reporter Steph Machado drove around South County tonight looking for people who are still in the dark. She joins us now live from the South County Mobile Newsroom. Steph? Well, Mike, it's really just been these pockets of spots with a few people out now, four days out from this storm. We were going around South Kingstown tonight to some of the neighborhoods still reporting outages. The good news is that some neighborhoods were finally turning back on tonight after neighbors tell us they had been out of power since Sunday night and again getting it back on today. Now, as of about an hour ago, National Grid is reporting that 95% of customers who lost power because of Sunday's storm now have it back on 95%. Many people have questioned why it took so long this many days to restore power. National Grid has said the damage from this storm has been one of the most disruptive in recent history. They brought in crews from other states. We've been seeing those trucks all over from Ohio to Mississippi. National Grid spokesman Ted Cressy says he understands customers frustrations and he says at the end of this process it can move a little more slowly because they're sending line crews to neighborhoods with just one or two customers in the dark. Maybe it's just, you know, one single line that's down connected to somebody's home or something. And, and those are the outliers, and that's what really takes time. That's why, you know, initially we go for the low-hanging fruit. We can knock out a bunch of customers at once. Uh, you know, this is where the slogging really gets going, and that's why it takes a little bit of time. But, you know, we've, we've got over 675 crews right now. We're going to get it done. We're going to get it done as quickly as possible. And, again, we just ask for our customers' patience. And this controversy won't be going away soon because Governor Gina Raimondo uh, ordered a review of National Grid's response to this storm. We reported that to you yesterday. Of course, that review won't take place until after the utility company gets everyone back online. And National Grid says they're aiming to have the vast majority on by midnight tonight. But they do say some people have estimated restoration times of tomorrow morning. Live in South Kingstown, I'm Steph Machado, Eyewitness News.